Hey everyone, so I've slowly been working on waking up a little bit earlier. I've woken up at 7.30 both mornings, this morning and yesterday. That made no sense. Went to the gym and it is now quarter to 10 already. This morning I'm going to film. I'm working on a sponsored video for Valentine's Day with a really awesome brand. One of my favorite brands in the world. So I'm so, 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 so excited to do that. I'm going to do a really bold Valentine's Day look. And I'm also going to do like a natural one as well, closer to the time. And then I'm also, I might do like a lip swatch video. And then I'm going to do um, a unboxing taste testing video with Hamish. That's my plans for today. And then I'm going to edit this afternoon. So um, I went to the gym this morning, had a shower already, moisturized. I was peeling real bad. So I like scrubbed at my chest. Whew, the lighting's a little bit crazy today. It's super sunny, but windy and cloudy. So the lighting should be interesting to film in. Hopefully I manage okay. I'm gonna make a really quick smoothie and then I'm going to blow dry my hair and get straight into it. I've got a lot to do today. I also got one package. I'll show you the package quickly and then I'll make my smoothie. And then I'm basically gonna run off, do my filming and I'll talk to you later. A little gift from Puma. My bet is their shoes because Looks like a shoebox size. Oh, I think these are shoes. Oh my gosh, look how cute. Hey, Shadam Puma and Global Cultural Icon Rihanna have announced a new multi-year partnership which kicked off in January this year. These suede creepers are the first shoe curated by Rihanna for Puma and is part of the Puma by Rihanna collection under the Fenty label. Oh my gosh, they are so cool. I know these aren't everyone's style, but I actually love these kind of shoes. I had a pair when I lived in Auckland a couple years ago and I loved them, except they were a half size too small. So every time I wore them, they like hurt me so bad, but they were the only size left, but yay. These ones will actually fit me. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited for these. Yay, thank you Puma. Puma, Puma, I don't know how to pronounce it. How do you pronounce it? Can you tell me? Can you tell me? So this is feeling lots better now, aren't you baby? Yeah. Why my camera is so bright right now? Wait on, I think I figured it out. So there we go, I must have messed with it at some stage. Anyways, let's give it a go. Oh, too much good green stuff. I actually love adding the coconut powder in there. It just is so refreshing. Like I don't usually like coconut water alone. Like I can drink it and like I feel good when I drink it. Like it literally makes me feel so much like more satisfied I guess like hydrated but the taste like bothers me occasionally but in this it's so good and refreshing like it makes your smoothie taste like I don't even know it's like water times 100 hydration so I did this makeup look I love it the lighting is kind of terrible but I did like pink and purples on my eyes love it perfect for like Valentine's Day for people that like a more bold look rather than super natural and girly you know like it's still girly but it's like badass as well <laughs> so now we're gonna film the unboxing taste test video and then i'm gonna edit for a while it is one o'clock already man i'm all finished filming hamish filmed with me so that was nice of him oh my gosh the food was so good so yeah now i'm just getting ready to edit i'm gonna get changed out of this top because i just want to put on something really comfy and baggy i haven't had lunch yet either i just realized i'm not really hungry it's really weird i got two more packages too i'll open these up quickly just before i get stuck into my editing by the way later on me and him should go into the movies i'm so excited we're gonna go see uh, i can't remember what it's called i'll tell you later all right so in the box was this how do i open it eh, my nails are too long oh simple gosh look who it is patrick star 
Ooh, Hi. I didn't even know this was happening. Vlogger. We're here today shooting with Formula X in my new place. I was so interested in becoming a makeup artist, so I figured practicing on myself, how could I relate to these girls that, oh, this would work for me, that would work for you. So that's when I started posting videos on YouTube. And just trial and error, just seeing what works, what doesn't. My followers would always want me to get my nails done. I would like pose and, you know, for Instagram or YouTube, they would be like, get your damn nails done. And I was like, okay. I got my first manicure a year ago. And then I found Formula X. I love Formula X because everything is beautiful from the nail care to the nail colors, the high shine. It's just flawless. I chose pink. And I received this CC cream by Manuka Doctor SPF 20. Hamish has vlogged this too already. He's vlogging today, so check out his channel. But we bought this recently. My auntie has one because she's got cats and they're grubby, like our dogs are grubby. And she recommended it. It was expensive. This is what we went to look for the other day. Remember how I said they had to order it in? Um, so it's called the Bissell Healthy Heat or Healthy Home Pro Heat. And basically it's a carpet cleaner. Um, and it's meant to be really good because the dogs bring in dirt and as I said the other day like Louis pees on the carpet sometimes and I don't know we just thought we'd give it a go because we don't want to get our carpet all ruined it's already got little stains here and there so I hope it's good just have to plug it in I guess cool and it just, there's a plug right there we're all assembled so hopefully this thing works well let's see how fast the water goes from clear to dirty those windows need to gr clean too, they're so grubby. Do you know how to work it? No. On. Yeah. So um, we've got it all up and ready to go. I think it's heating now, because I turned the heater on. Louis, move. Um, I should raid. Yeah, we probably should read the menu. So we'll see if it removes this mark here that we couldn't get out. Huh? You and your dirt. Okay, so can you see it? Yeah. Recording on both? Yeah. So we're gonna see if we can get rid of this stain. So it definitely works, it's so much faster than when we had to get like the boiling water out and like you know, all the napkins and stuff. All right, I'm dressed. Time to do some groceries, and we're gonna go out for dinner and head to the movies. <laughs> so we've put away the groceries, and now we're gonna go for dinner. I think we're either gonna go to um, what is it called? My vlog. Portofino. Yeah, vlog copier. What? You're copying my vlog. All own stuff. No, you're copying my vlog. No, you're, clop you're copying my vlog. No. Let's go. You can drive. I might do this. Got the bruschetta to start. Yum. This is my one. Here's my mushroom um, pin. What? Wait, wait. What was it? I can't even remember what it was called. You know what I mean? I showed you. No, we're not vlogging the same stuff, Matt. So <laughs> we're going into the theaters now. I'll let you guys know how the movie is in a minute. Oh my gosh, there's I'm no really, point in us both vlogging. So we have just arrived at downtown cinemas, and we are gonna see the fifth wave. Ooh. Hopefully, oh. it's good. I'll let you know. Yo, what up? So we just finished at the fifth wave. 
we liked it. I saw someone comment on my video saying they didn't like it because it was like cliche. Like I can see like there were some like cheesy bits. There like, always is a movie. But there though. always is. Nah, but I thought it was actually really good. Like, I didn't see most of it coming until it was like happening. I was like, oh, is it? And then it was, or like whatever. But it was really good. I liked it. I reckon it's worth watching. I reckon it was good. Yeah. I just we were just saying like we wish that the like disaster bits, because like obviously you've seen that if you've seen the shorts of the movie, how there's little bits of disasters. I wish they were a bit longer. It was good. I don't want to say too much because I don't want to ruin it for everyone. But there was some good twists that you, I don't think oh, yeah. you see coming. Yeah, there's good twists and stuff. Like, it's not just, like, simple, you know? It's really good. And I reckon there must be a second one, too. So, I hope there is. Because, yeah, I'd watch it. See, I'm going to end my vlog now. It's 10.35. Um, yeah, talk to you tomorrow. Bye.